ice hockey is played indoors on an artificial ice surrounded by boards. The game always starts with the referee dropping the puck onto the ice, a so-called face-off. Each game consists of three 20-minute periods, and the team that scores the most goals in the opponent's net wins the game. If the result is tied and the 60 minutes are played, there is a five-minute overtime, followed by a shootout if no goals are scored. The playing area, or rink as it is called in ice hockey, consists of three zones. Each team has its own zone, and then there is a neutral zone. The center of the ice is marked by a red line, and the team's zones are marked by a blue line. Each team consists of 22 players, and there are six players on the ice at the same time. Five skaters and one goalie. Players on the ice switch with those on the bench approximately every minute. There are also four referees on the ice. They make sure that the players follow the rules. You recognize the referees by their black and white striped jerseys. Ice hockey is played with a lot of equipment. All skaters wear skates, a helmet on their head, gloves on their hands, and a stick in their hand. Additional protective gear is worn on other parts of the body. The ball of the sport is a puck, a flat, hard little object made of rubber. If a player violates the rules, such as hitting someone with their stick, they can receive a penalty from the referees. This results in sitting out of the game for two minutes. During penalties, the team with five players has a power play, and the team with four players is on the penalty kill. The penalized player can return to the game if the opposing team scores. When the game is interrupted, the clock stops. Time is only counted when the players are actively playing. Two examples of common breaks are icing and offside. Icing occurs when a player shoots from their own defensive zone all the way down over the extended goal line. Offside means that the puck must enter the offensive zone before the players do. If the puck is ahead of the players, there is a face-off outside the zone. The crowd is crucial for the teams on the ice, especially for the home team. If the crowd cheers, sings and supports the team, it's more likely for them to win the game. 